Okay, Lofty. We're ready for the doors now. Oh, oh, okay, Bob. Uh, Bob, before you do that, isn't there something you wanted to say to the moms and dads and grandparents and other grown-ups out there? Oh, yes. I nearly forgot. <clears throat> I'd like to tell you a bit about what we do. <laughs> we have fun. Yeah. <laughs> Rock and roll. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Tizzy and Rolly. You're right, but that's not all we do. Is it? Oh. When children watch us on TV, building and fixing, it makes them feel like going and doing something, too. Wow! Yeah, that's, that's fantastic! And roll. Oh, uh, that's good. Brilliant! I thought we were just a gang of building machines. Oh, you're more than that, Dizzy. When children see you working together to get a job done, they can see the problems can be solved working as a team. Uh... I have a problem, Wendy. What is it, Scoop? How do I unload these doors? They're heavy. <laughs> no problem. Lower your hook. Easy does it. Okay, and lift. Oh, um, now what do I do, Bob? Bring the doors over here, Lofty. Then we can position them. I'll help. And I'll cheer. Me too. Yay! Rock and roll! There! Dizzy, can you mix some mortar? Okay, Bob. Good. Then we can fix them into place. You see? Working together... We solved the problem! <laughs> oh, oh, I just made a new problem all by myself. Don't worry, Dizzy. I can wipe that off. Can we fix it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Uh, well, I think so. See you later. Bye, everyone. All right, now remember, Bob, Mrs. Potts will be here in the morning to take care of the office work. Don't worry about us, Wendy. You just enjoy your visit with your sister. Oh, I will. Oh, my, she's got a lovely garden with a patio and everything, unlike mine, which is a complete mess. Oh, well, now. Uh, Bob. Oh, all right, yes. Wendy, you better get going or you'll miss your train. All right. Bye, everyone. See you tomorrow night. Bye. Goodbye. I'll send Scoop to pick you up from the station. Oh, I miss Wendy when she's not here. Don't worry, Dizzy. We'll be too busy to miss her. What do you mean, Bob? I've just had an idea. We're going to fix Wendy's garden up so it's as nice as her sister's. Oh, oh good, good idea, idea, Bob. Yeah. I like a little gardening. Yeah. I'll do all the flat bits. We haven't got much time, though. We'll have to start bright and early in the morning. <laughs> All right, Pilchard, I'll get your breakfast now. Oh. Boss Building Yard. Oh, hello, Mrs. Potts. Oh, my. Well, don't worry. You just stay in bed and get better. Bye. Oh, well, I guess we'll manage somehow. All right, Pilchard. I'm coming. There won't be anyone in the office, so I'll leave the answering machine on and look in now and then to check the messages. So we're still going to work on Wendy's garden then? Of course we are. Great! Can we fix it? Yes, we can! Uh, yeah, I think so. All right, Scoop and Rolly, I've ordered some flagstones, turf, and tubs from the garden center. You can go and pick them up. No problem, Bob. Buck, Dizzy, and Lofty, you're on gardening duties. Let's get these timbers loaded. Oh, all right, Bob. All right, let's see. We'll have a bit of lawn in the middle, a patio by the house, and over there, we'll put up a pergola. Uh, what's a pergola? A big wooden frame thing. Very nice for sitting under. Oh, can we have some flowers, please? Wendy loves flowers. Great idea, Dizzy. We'll put a flower bed over there. 
and I'll order some plans when I get back to the office later. All right, everyone. Let's get to it. I'm just going back to the office, check the messages, and order those plants. Okay, Bob. Can I give you a ride? Good idea, Lofty. It'll save time. See you later. Bye, Bob. Hello? Is that Bob's building yard? Hello? Oh, my goodness. Hello? Hello? Oh. Now, how did that happen? Oh, no. There's a load of messages, too. Hello, is that box building yard? I was wondering if you could buy them. Oh. 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 Why do I always have trouble with this answer machine? Where's that instruction book? Oh, never mind. I'll take care of it later. I must send this fax to the garden center. All right, plants have been ordered. Oh no, nearly three o'clock. I better get back to Wendy's garden. See you later, Pilchard. All right, Lucky, step on it. Hello. Oh great, here comes Scoop and Rolly. All right, everybody. We've got the stuff from the garden center. Now we can finish off the job. But, but Bob, what about the flowers? Oh, I've ordered them, Dizzy. You and Muck can go and pick them up. Oh, giddy! I forgot my pitchfork. Come on, Lofty. Where did I put that pitchfork? Ah, there it is. Oh my goodness. What's happened here? It's no good looking all innocent pilcher. When Wendy sees this, we'll both be in trouble. Now, how am I supposed to fix this? Oh, too late. It's six o'clock. When he'll be back soon. Oh, come on, everybody. We've got to get a move on. Well, we're all done, Bob. There's just the pergola to finish off and the flowers to plant. Don't panic. I'm on the case. Scoop, you better go and meet Wendy. Go on. What on earth's that noise coming from my garden? Oh, that. Uh, that's just a, a, a woodpecker. <laughs> if it is, it's the biggest one in the world. Wendy! Close your eyes and come with me. Oh, what's going on? <laughs> okay, you can open your eyes now. Surprise, surprise! It's beautiful. A patio. Oh, just right for barbecues. A pergola. I'll be able to sit outside on summer evenings. Oh, and a lovely flower bed with all of my favorite plants. Oh, Bob, thank you. Thanks, all of you. Ah. 
In all the excitement, I forgot to ask you, Bob. Did Mrs. Potts manage all right in the office? Ah, uh, well, she couldn't make it. She was sick, and everything's in a bit of a mess. In fact, I was wondering if you could come in early and take care of it. <laughs> Do you mean, can I fix it? Oh, whoa, Wendy. <laughs> yes, of course I can. Oh, it's really nice to know I've been missed. Anyway, I don't mind at all. Because I know that when I come home at the end of the day, I can just relax, and then I can have... Oh, Bob, do you think I should have a fountain? <laughs> fountain? <sighs> Building, Bob? Hmm? Oh, it's a moat for my sandcastle, Muck. Watch. Wow! wow. Ta-da! That's a great job, Bob. What's it for? Well, a castle moat stops the enemy getting into the castle. Or out! <laughs> That's right, Muck. I know. Let's build our own sandcastle and moat, Scoop. Yeah, that sounds like fun. Will you help us, Bob? Of course I will. Oh, great. Uh, but I'm in charge. <laughs> I'll get my pail and shovel. Here's a good spot, Scoop. I'll start building the sandcastle. And I'll dig out the moat. Hmm. Scoop, you start digging at the seashore and then in a circle right around me, just like Bob did. No prob, Muck. I'll do the big bits of the sandcastle, Bob. You do the little bit. Okay. Oh, this is great. Can we fix it? Yes, yes we, we can. Yes, Bob? Look where the moat goes. It goes right around us, Bob. Oh! Now we're stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Muck. I'll fill the moat back in. Thanks, Scoop. It's hard being in charge, isn't it, Bob? <laughs> yes, Muck. Oh, oh, hello, Dizzy. No. What's the matter, Spot? You don't look very well. Uh, oh, I'm not very well. It's all these apples I ate. But I thought you loved apples. Oh, I do, I do. But that's the problem. Apples taste great. Oh, they're really yummy. I can eat them all day and fill my tummy. I can eat them up raw, shake them off a tree. Cause when they're rosy and ripe, <laughs> they're ready for me. An apple a day is what they say. It's supposed to keep the doctor away. But eat too many and you're asking for trouble. You'll get tummy ache and bend over double. But best of all is warm apple pie that's served with ice cream. Smell it and sigh. I try to be good and really polite, but I gobble it all down after only one bite. Oh, 
Oh, thanks, Muck. Okay, you two. It shouldn't take long to finish these repairs. See you back at the yard. Bye, Bob. Yeah, see you later. <sighs> Not working today, Spud? Nah, it's too hot. And we've been... We've been... <sighs> Give it the day off. <laughs> Not by me, you haven't. Go on, back to work, you two. Hey, yes, Farmer Pickles. Sorry, Farmer Pickles. Blood's on the job, Farmer Pickles, sir. Phew, <laughs> 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 Rolly, it's really hot. Yeah, you. Let's take a break, okay? <laughs> Is the work too hard for you? Yeah, can you only go slow? Hey, I like things nice and slow. Beep, 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 beep. We're faster workers than you any day. Farmer Pickles says I'm the fastest tractor he's ever had. Yeah, so... <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. I'm still faster than you are. Are not. Am too. Are not. Prove it. How? Why don't you race each other? All right, Spud. Oh, uh, I will race you, Travis. Oh, uh, uh, all right. Yeah, right. Today at noon, meet you at the duck pond. All right, come on, Rolly. We'd better tell Bob. Wait for me. Oh, Spud, what have I done? I shouldn't have said I'd race Scoop. I'll lose. Why? Farmer Pickle said you were the fastest tractor. Didn't he? Travis? Uh, not exactly. He said I was the fastest talker he's ever had, not the fastest tractor. I've never been in a race in my life. Travis. Travis, 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 Travis! Dizzy, where's Bob? We need his help for the race. What race? What's all the noise about, Scoop? Hi, Bob. I need you to help me with the race. Race? What race? I'm having a race against Travis at noon by the duck pond. Oh, how exciting. Oh, we must get organized. If you're having a race, you'll need a course to race around. Isn't that right, Bob? Yes, Wendy. They'll need a racetrack. Bob, can you fix it? <laughs> yes, I can. Hooray! <laughs> Scoop's going to win. Scoop's going to win. All right, Muck, you better come with me. <laughs> Come on, Ooh. Travis, move it, move it, Ooh. move it. Ooh. You're not fast enough. Ooh. 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 It's no use. You'll never beat Scoop like this. Ooh. Ooh, I know. Sorry. So, I'll have to think of something. Good job, Muck. Now let's get back and join the others at the start. Okay, Bob. <laughs> okay, everybody. I've drawn a map of the race course. Scoop, Travis, you start here at the pond, follow the arrows down the country lane into the town, pass the yard, back into the country again, and finish back here. So... Take your places! Ready? Go, Scoop, go! Uh, quiet, quiet, please. Sorry, Bob. Ready? Get, Get set? set? Go! Bob, how are we gonna see who's winning from here? Hmm. Good point, Muck. Oh, I know. Lofty, can you lift me up to the barn roof? Uh, yeah. I think so, Bob. Good. Let's go, then. Okay. Going up. Careful up there, Bob. Whoa! Hey, hey! Great view! I can see the yard from here, Lofty. But well, what about Scoop and Travis? Oh, yeah. Um... And we're off to a flying start now with Scoop in the lead. Go, Scoop, go! Wow, this is exciting, isn't it? Uh, oh, jump up, Elchard. Then you can see better. Oh, I've never seen a race before. Can 
scoop win it? Yes, he can! To. What? Uh, oh, uh, Hey, that's the stuff that was slowing me down. Oh, Spud, that's not the kind of help I wanted. Um, uh, I can explain. Uh, you see, it was, uh, was like this. Um, it was just a joke, and, uh, Spud, I, what's uh, the... Uh, uh, Phew, that's it. Oh, just need a little bit of mortar over here, please, Dizzy. That's putty, Muck. It's soft now, but soon it'll set hard and hold the glass in place. That's really cool. There. Great job. Thanks, team. You've all worked really hard. Mr. Sabatini will be really pleased when he sees them. Aha. Uh -huh. And these are no ordinary doors. Watch this. Wow. They closed all on their own. That's really kind of weird. Ready, everyone? Oh, uh, look out, Bob! The doors are closed! Ta-da! Cool! It's like magic! Wow! They open and shut and everything! Oh, Bob! Can I have a turn? Be my guest, Dizzy! <laughs> my turn! No, Mark! You're too big! You <laughs> Oh, them! Those doors thought I was going inside and I wasn't! <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. You had me worried there, Muck. <laughs> oh, Muck, they're not mind-reading doors. 
There's a sensor up there. Look. And that senses when something's moving in front of it and opens the doors. Cool. That's really clever. Yes, but not as clever as you. You can do lots of different things. And so can you, can't you? Especially when you work as a team, the way we do. Of course, we're not all good at everything. No, we all do different things. But put us together. And can we fix it? Yes, yes we, we can! can. Uh, yeah, yes, we can. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye.